Come here. Come here. Why are you acting this way? Because you have a potato bug in a cup. Don't make me look at it. In this cup? Come on, take a quick look. No, 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 no. he's gonna jump out. He's not. Stop it. They, they don't jump. They don't jump. See? There he is. He's a little bit bigger than most of the bugs we found in the house. Go away. No, no, please. You're gonna accidentally uh, fling it at me. No, I'm not. Kathy doesn't like bugs. Seriously. No bugs at all. But this house is full of them. Oh, and by the way, good morning. This is Vlog 528. What's up, girl? Today is an interesting day. Uh, we are doing a couple things today. We are? Well, I'm doing one thing at 3 o'clock. I have a, a radio interview for Wheels and Waves, which is pretty cool. Car, car radio. I think it's Wrench Nation. I'm, I think that's what it is. And then tonight we're going to a an event in Marina del Rey. Is it? It's being put on by... Uh, What's in these bags? Well, I'm going to show you. This is what's in the bags. That's not what I was thinking, but that's still good. Better. But this. Wow, is that a commercial for Santino's? <laughs> Somebody's in the back of the cop car. There's a guy. It is dumping right now. Severely dumping. I have my snow hat on because I was wishing it was snowing. We we I'm gonna pretend it is. <laughs> we decided we're not going to the Dr. Schultz event because it's dumping. Uh, there are rivers where there shouldn't be rivers. I'm gonna go up into town and get Bacon some stuff. Jerky. The new Jeep Willys just appeared. This is the Rubicon. That's going adios. Let's go check out the new Willys. That's going to be awesome. 
Now I'm in the Jeep Willys. Uh, I'm waiting for a spot to open up, and then I'm gonna show you guys what this thing looks like. It's, it's kind of like the Jeep I just had, but it's manual. It's a lot smaller, and it's super badass. Crystal metallic with a black interior. Awesome. Back in the Jeep again. This is the, the Wrangler Willys that we're in now. Different Jeep. Different Jeep. And the reason that we're in the Jeep is because we just read in the news that a mudslide literally just happened. So sinkhole. Sinkhole. Like like just like 20 minutes ago. So we're gonna race up there and see what we can spot. You know, it just poured like a mother this uh, earlier today. Uh, couldn't go outside necessarily or want to go outside, but uh, today has been one of those uh, creatively challenged days where, you know, not things just don't kind of flow all that well, and it's kind of up here. It's kind of like um, you get into a flow of things, you get into that that zone, that mode, and then it and it dumps rain, and then and the rain kind of messes everything up. You can't go out into the shop. You can't. Um, uh, the, the fluidity is, is not. I'm sure you guys have have dealt with, with you know a a block in creative flow sometimes, and that's a challenge because you you want things to flow smoothly, you want things to to happen, and uh, you know for this vlog I want to be able to show you guys really cool cars and cool stuff. And when it rains and the whole outside is all messed up, you can't really show all that much. That's that's uh, the cool factor. Uh, I can't show you know all the times things like that. Look at the size of that boulder that showed up. It just happened to roll down the hill. No, thank God no one was there at the time. But you know what? That boulder is actually smaller than some of them. There's been some that they were so large they had to blow them up with dynamite. And they blew them up and they turned into like a thousand boulders uh, that size. But what did we do? What did we do today that was, that was cool? Well, we got the Jeep, the 2017 Jeep Wrangler Willys, that was freaking cool. Uh, it is a manual, didn't get a chance to show you too much of that. I'm saving that for the next couple of vlogs, but right off the heels of the, the Rubicon, which was freaking awesome, an amazing, amazing vehicle. This is like the shorter version, uh, the two-door version, uh, like I said, manual, about $35,000. Not sure what the horsepower is and all that kind of stuff, but I'm gonna get that for you guys in a couple of vlogs from now. I do know it's about 18 miles per gallon. You can get into one of these, uh, into the base model at about 23,000. Not all that expensive considering we bought a Jeep back in 1998 or 1999. We bought one for $20,000, which was kind of around the same. But they haven't really increased in price uh, all that much. Uh, I think that was a B6, I think this one is too. There's a significant difference when, you know, the one that we had in had no air conditioning, bare bones, you know, uh, uh, rolling up the windows. Uh, everything is electronic nowadays. And there's tons of cool stuff in it. So, you know, right off the bat, you know, we, we, fall, we fall in love with cars like this. You know, Kathy and I both like adventure cars, things that you get in and then psh, you go off and have an adventure. But outside thinking that uh, there was a big landslide, there was, it wasn't a landslide, it was like a sinkhole. It was like this, this big, something, something happens and doesn't happen the way you expect it to be. You can't get down, you can't get depressed about it, you know, because that, that depression does you no good. You gotta, you gotta kind of roll with the punches. You just gotta parry and kind of move out of the way of those things and just kind of keep moving forward. And that's the theme for today. You know, uh, it doesn't matter whether it's rain or a thunderstorm, maybe you get electrocuted because you stick your finger in the socket. Whatever it is that happens, it's all good because that actually could kill you. But if it didn't kill you, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. And that has to be your attitude. You have to have the attitude of success. And success means that no matter what comes at you, you're gonna barrel on through, you're gonna succeed, you're gonna survive, and things are gonna get better. You gotta believe that. 
and the next few days is nothing but sun, and that means wheels and waves coming in on Sunday. It's going to be epic. It's going to be an extraordinary show. We've got all kinds of amazing cars. The Automobile Drive Museum just told me what they're ringing. It's going to be sick, but what I'm driving is going to be sicker. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hang out with us. We're having a blast. There's some fantastic stuff coming. That's it, people. We'll see you tomorrow.